You're listening to Drive Sweet Said. I'm your host, Kirk Swenson. I'm here every Tuesday between 4 and 5 o'clock. Welcome. Thanks for joining me today. I have a mix of music. Oh, the beauty of being the volunteer music director was being able to see all the new music and hear all the new music when it comes into the station. The hardest thing was when I left the position and I had to walk out of here on a Tuesday at you know 5.15 when I was done and there was nine bubble wrap mailers with new CDs in there. And I didn't know what was in there, but yeah. I wanted to know what was in there. It's all locally made and that's amazing. These are people in Monona who live in Monona, who love everything about Monona and they're just going on air and sharing what's going on in the community. It's literally local. <laughs> everything about it is local. The volunteers and, and, and Kirk just stepping in and essentially taking on what a professional music director and music programmer and station manager in some cases would be doing or program director would be doing and it's great they they win awards they do amazing work because the volunteers love the station so much they they understand the approach that was taken from the get-go and didn't really question it they understood it and went yeah this is this is great this is perfect and the volunteers ran with it and they're the ones who keep the sound and the coolness factor and the community factor and the cuteness factor and all those things they all do so well um, at making sure that stays the way it is and besides the music which is an americana mix i think one of the things that is um important for the station as will said is the uh, community base when the floods were happening three summers ago i think we have lots of information about uh, where sandbags were, where to pick them up, where to get help if you need help with them, because that was a big deal in a, in a community that's fronted by a lake. WVMO is so special because it's a community radio station. It's been around for over five years now. We're also a non-commercial station. So, you know, you're not gonna hear how many ever minutes of music on this station uh, like you do on the commercial stations. So it's, it's got the best of both worlds. It's very community oriented and there's no commercials that are bugging you every three songs, four songs, whatever. Everybody just loves it so much and it's all volunteer driven. So there's not money behind it. Like everything is just because people love radio and their community.